Ah, Lady Luck. Le jeu Noir Paramount, number two. Two is the winner. Your chips, monsieur. Merci. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. My wartime communications from Salvador. He's been sending me messages like this for the last year. Agent Calavera, I have word that you arrived in Rubacaba safely. This is great news, as your service to the LSA may now continue. I am pleased to report the successful hatching of the eggs you liberated. The hatchlings, which Eva has named Manny and Meche, are quite healthy and eager to serve our cause. With luck, my next letter will be borne to you across the sky by these young gossamer wings of truth. For the revolution, Salvador Limones. I'm not done reading it yet, but maybe later. Everything okay down here? I'm going to need some more chips if Monsieur Lucky does not call it a night. You know, some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Not while they're losing. Not while they're losing. Le numéro gagnant, le 3, rouge. Empire Monk. Three, red, house pays all winners. An honest roulette croupier is hard to find. And guys like this, even harder. Le Banque by Police Chief Bogan. Ruba Cava's finest. Mesdames et Messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ruba Cava's only, for that matter. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. Ah, my bread and butter. Thrill-seeking rich folk with a poor grasp of statistics and probability. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't really betting wanna do is that. closed. No more bets, please. I don't really want to do that. Le numéro gagnant, le 17, noir, Empire Monk. 17. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I just had a run-in with Domino and Meche. We're leaving town. What? What? How? Domino's got Meche. We're going after them tonight. What should I do? Just sit here until I get a boat. Sit here. Check. Okay. Sounds good. I know it. Later. Out. You know, some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Le numéro gagnant. Manny. Can you make reasonable union cards? Manny! Are you going to start moonlighting? Or are you just looking to hang out with the sailors? Can you do it or not? Hmm. I have a deal for you. If you can retrieve my money from Maximino, I can make you president of that crooked union. I don't need to be president. 
And why does Max have your money? I put a whole suitcase of it up for collateral on a rather large wager last month. The race was fixed, Manny. They stole my money like common thieves. Here, take this VIP pass and use it to get into the High Rollers Lounge. They won't let me in there anymore. There should be a safe somewhere in the wine cellar, and my suitcase should be in it. And you can get me a card tonight. If you make it back, Manny, the card will be on the table. Le numéro gagnant, le 23, rouge, entre les passes. Calavera, it is indeed a great day for the revolution. Say hola to little Manny, the first enlisted messenger to serve the LSA. Please feed him some breadcrumbs and send him back quickly, so we may know that our maiden flight was a success. It's the VIP pass for the High Rollers Lounge that Chow Chilla Charlie gave me. Ooh, better not show that to Gladys. Check out this fancy pass to the High Rollers Lounge. Can you believe how full of themselves they are over there? I don't think their place is any more VIP than ours, do you? I don't know. I, I try to stay away from th that place. Really? Why? Because of my, my, my problem. Gladys? Compadre? Scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Well, maybe just a sip. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. Oh, you're clean. Rats, Manny, I almost got to strip search you. Are you sure I can't just... Don't touch. <laughs> Sir, if you will... <laughs> oh, you're cl... Rats, Manny, I almost got... Manuel, I am sorry to hear that you have not heard from your meche. You must be patient. 
Let your heart remain open. If it is meant to be, you will someday be reunited. Ha! Huh. He still thinks I'm in love with her. De oro. Well, maybe just. Ah. I don't think I could swallow any more metal. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings. You sure you're not packing anything else? Nothing that would set off that thing. Then, sir, I'm afraid you'll have to step into the back with me. Rules are rules. <clears throat> and of course, with my dad being in the military, we moved around a lot. Mm -hmm. I remember this one town we moved to when I was in the first grade. Oh, really? Yeah, the only industry in the area was figs. Acres and acres of fig trees everywhere you looked. That's interesting. I myself never really cared for figs. I always liked dates more. Or prunes. Don't you just love prunes? They have never such a, a great big fan texture. Of They're all wrinkled up like my grandma Hedwig's face. Oh. Speaking of metal detectors. Poor grandma Hedwig. Did you just come back here to ask to borrow my metal detector? Yes. What is it with you in this thing? I'm sick of it, Manny. If this is all you want, you can fight the cats for it. Why is it all men are after the same thing? Except you. The only woman you care about is that Colomar dame, and she split on you. I don't know what she did to you, but you know what? I'm done trying to figure it out, pal. Carla. These lockers have a note on them. Employees, I don't care who's doing it, but please stop using the contained detonation chamber to crack open walnuts. Thank you. You wouldn't happen to have a second metal detector around here, would you? Ugh. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. And then jump out the damn window. Oh, Carla. Sir, if you... And then jump... Oh. Well, that's the hole I saw Carla's metal detector fall through. Oh, no. It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for Kitty. Great. Now it smells like a giant cat litter box and some sort of gelatinous demon mystery meat product in here. Scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade.
Aha! A little stinky, but it could be worse. Hi, what's your name? Hi, what's your name? Hey, can I borrow this book? Why? So you can freak out our plans for organizing labor and go rat us out to your pal, Chief Morgan? Hey, I'm just looking for something to read on the can, all right? No dice, Cumberbund. Hi, what's your name? Testing. 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 All right! Who's ready to rock and roll? Maybe later then, okay? Good evening. I like to read a poem. The cracks in my skull. Beholding, I crave disappointment. I am more than dead. Beholding dick this real. The lie. Can you hear me saying nothing? My teeth. Beholding forgive these five sins. Unify. Rectify. It lingers. Go, baby. B and S. Gracias. Muchísimas gracias. Lola? What are you doing here? This crowd doesn't go much for souvenir pictures, except maybe of Lenin. Shh! Manny, I'm on a stakeout! I'm gonna prove to Maximino once and for all that Olivia's no good for him. Still hung up on Max, eh? Take my advice, Angel. Forget about him. He's a gambling racketeer. <laughs> like you. Oh, that hurts, baby. Hey, shh! Here they come! Come on, sugar. How about a kiss for the road? Oh, ick. Don't let me down, Nick. You're a lawyer. You're not supposed to have feelings. I don't, but I know a good tart when I see one. Hey! If Maximino sees that, we're going to end up in matching terracotta pots. Don't be silly. He wouldn't hurt me. He loves me. <sighs> Manny. At last, we're alone. Tell me, how are the bourgeoisie? Fine. How's Max? Oh, Gramps, don't start. What are you doing with a snake like Nick? I'd lay it on you, Manny, but uh, I don't think you'd get it. Max? 
Messing around with your boyfriend's lawyer is pretty dangerous. Oh, maybe I was wrong. You do get it. I'm a little worried about Lola. That's because she's doomed, Manny. She fell in love with Maximino. That's the one mistake I never made. You think Nick would hurt her? Only if he finds her and take it from me. He's not good at finding things. Open mic night seems like a big hit. It always takes those timid souls a while to get up the nerve. Maybe it would help if you... Oh, Manny, read poetry in my own club? That would be like this whole place was just a big temple set up to work. Oh, okay. The cracks in my skull. Beholding. I crave disappointment. I am more than in dead. Beholding. Dig this reap the lie. Can you hear me saying nothing? My teeth. Beholding, forgive, forgive these five sins. Unify, Unify rectify. rectify, it lingers. Go, Go baby. baby. Hey, you stole my poem. Consider it an homage. Well, Catch you later, hip chick. Keep practicing. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumberbund. So, uh, what did you think of the poem? I liked it. It was sad and beautiful, like my mother. I despised it. It was too short, it said nothing to me, like my father. I had no feelings about it. It was aloof and licked itself too much, like my cat, Mr. Trotsky. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumberbund. A little dark in here, don't you think? Dark and cold, like the hearts of men. Uh... Hey! Okay! Alive! We Life's, Life's just, just some rapid eye movement. movement. In a warm, cozy bed. Buried. We, we wake. wake. The flesh the dream, dream is over, over daddy. daddy. Now, now that we're all crazy dead. dead. That was great! Yeah. But that's the last one. Well, keep practicing. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumberbund. You know, I'm thinking of buying this place. Really? I thought about buying yours for a while. But then I just decided to ask my boyfriend, Max to buy it for me. You can have it. I'm leaving town. Manny, you sound so exciting all of a sudden. Why are you leaving town? Johnny Law, baby. You see, I'm a grifter. I'm bad news. Yeah, right. You're running after that ghost chick everyone says you're still so uptight about. Well, I have a poem I wrote just for you. Pay attention, because it's pretty short. Here it goes. Ch uh. <laughs> well, keep practicing. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumber. Hey. Okay. To ashes, to ashes, to ashes, to ashes. To ashes, to ashes, to me. To ashes, to ashes, to ashes, to ashes. That was great. Yeah, but... Well, keep practicing. Testing. 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 
Anyone out there know where I can find some tools? The only tool in here is you. Yeah, tool of the government, monkey rancher. So what is up with airplane food anyway? Is he trying to be funny? I mean, it's so small and not that good. There's nothing funny about being dead, comrade. Life is pain, death is worse. My funny bone must have fell off in the hearse. Hey, can anyone out there help me get into the Maritime Union? Hey, we're into organizing labor, not sabotaging labor. I like to read an eating through your I I crave disappointment. I am your failure. Eruption. Grotesque. Can you hear what I'm suffering? Fiddle dee dee. I crave ashes to ashes. Absolution. Forgive. Absolute. In the slaughterhouse of my soul. Does he hear? Hear. Wallow. B and Gracias. Muchis. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumberbund. But don't you see? When the government fades away, so will our troubles. Ah, nonsense. We will always need some armed force to fight off the return of capitalism. That sort of fascist thinking is as dead as you are, comrade. When we get rid of all the guns, that's when people will begin to self-police. And the public opinion alone will keep them from committing crimes. Hola, trust funders. Hey, look who's making the scene. It's Manny Calavera, the up, the down, the backside of the nouveau riche. Be it, dinner jacket. We're talking about things you wouldn't understand, like truth and beauty. Buenas noches, comrades. Hey, Manny, no offense, but we don't have time for establishment types like yourself. What makes you guys think I'm so establishment? You smell like bacon and oppression, man. Okay. Manuel, we have found the head of the serpent. Using the computer access you provided us, we picked up a thread that led us to the man who corrupted the Department of Death. His name is Hector Le Mans. Once a small-time racketeer, he has grown fat and powerful by robbing the newly dead. Watch out for the name Hector Le Mans, Manuel. And be careful. Dear friend, our movement now has true momentum, and our numbers are rapidly growing. Much of this is due to our communications and intelligence systems both of which we owe to you. In light of your contributions, I would like to announce your promotion to special agent status. I, Salvador Limones of the Lost Souls Alliance, salute you, Manuel Calavera. You are a great ally in this noble revolution. Great news. We've discovered a new secret talent of our tiny messengers. We don't know how they do it, but these mysterious birds can actually find their targets just by looking at a photograph of the addressee. To celebrate, Eva has made them all little berets. I'll send you some pictures. I don't really want to do that. 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 Labor organization and revolt made easy. Hey, look, deadbeats.
did I ever tell you guys that you remind me of my friend, Salvador Limones? Salvador Limones is a fairy tale, a spook story the man tells the masses as he puts them to sleep. Idiot! Salvador Limones is a very real and a very great, great man. He also writes a mean letter. What is this? I, Salvador Limones, salute you. Manuel Calavera? A great ally in this noble revolution. You really know Salvador Limones? What's he like? Why didn't you tell us you were a freedom fighter, Manuel? I can't talk about my underground gig, man, where I put the whole scene in Dangerville. Wow. Heavy. Hey, uh, I've got a split, so, um... Viva la revolucion. Oh, man. Would you cats mind if I dug on this book for a while? Knock yourself out, brother. Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny. I have a note for you from Lola. Lola? Yes. Now, where is it? Where, 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 where? Oh, here. No, wait. Dang. I have a whole new system for messages. Just let me... Here. No, no, wait. Ah, be quiet. Here it is. Wait a second. It's empty. There was something inside. It felt like a key. A key? Yes! But did somebody come back here and snake the key while I was sorting the coats? Who would do that? They messed up my whole system! Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny. Okay, back to work. Okay!
can do it! This is it! Punch it, buddy! Looks like a turkey baster. That monster upstairs is running me ragged. Oh, but monsieur, je suis très désolé. There are no guests allowed in the kitchen. I must ask you to leave. In a minute, Leroy. Raoul. What are you doing working in the High Roller Lounge? I would think Maximino's private lawyer would have his own office. I do, but they don't serve drinks there. Got a little lipstick on you, lover boy. I already got rid of that. And I can do the same to you, Calavera. So if I were you, I'd keep my jaw shut. Nick, I need a lawyer. You get yourself in some kind of trouble, Calavera. I'm starting a class action suit. Lots of money involved. Who are you deep pocketing? What's the difference to you? They're loaded. So will you be needing a regular lawyer or an excellent lawyer? That's a good cat. You got it. An excellent lawyer. Any excellent lawyer or the best excellent lawyer. Get up, you stupid cat! The very best is good enough for me. And who would you say that would be, Calavera? Who would you say is the best lawyer you know in all the land of the dead? That's a good cat. You are, Nick. That's right. And that's why Maximino retains me on an exclusive basis. So, sorry, but I don't do odd jobs. He'd see me do it. How's tricks, Nick? Yeah. Virago, I really need a lawyer. Well, my dance card is full. So what are you gonna do? What's that? That's a good chat. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. That sort of claim could send a man like Max into quite a rage, especially if the messenger had no proof. Max and I are friends. He'll believe me. People believe what they want to believe, Calavera. And I want to believe you're a smart man who doesn't go around spreading dangerous rumors. I've got to talk to Max for a moment. When I get back, I hope you're gone, because I'm sick of looking at you. This is gonna get me in trouble. I don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. That's a good cat. Get that mouse!
sir, if you... And then oh, Carla. What's that? I don't know. I found it under your desk. Unattended? No, there was a shifty-looking guy with crazy eyes who put it there. Oh, my God. Give me that! It's a bomb! Another senseless act of terrorism nipped in the bud by security officer Carla. Wow. It was completely destroyed by our own detonator, so I can't tell what kind of bomb it was. But here's something. A key? I better bring that to Chief Bogan. Yeah, you can analyze it with your metal detector. Full of waiter. Oh, please don't do that. I do not like the tiny places, monsieur. No, 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 not one little bit. Look, I have no time for games of this nature. If I don't get these drinks, the customers will storm the kitchen looking for their orders. I don't want to mess up my blade. Looks like the pantry. Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. Almost there! idea you like gambling so much, Gladys. Well, the doctors made me promise I wouldn't do it anymore. You're doing it! Almost there! Go, go, go! Almost there! I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to out. My 
scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Oh, please don't do that. That ought to keep the food from getting away. Merci. Hello? Hello out there? Could somebody please open the door? <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I seem to have uh, locked myself in this teeny tiny room. I am actually very close to a phobic, so if somebody, uh, s'il vous plaît, s'il vous plaît, oh, let me out of here immediately! Oh, oh, oh. Go, go, go! Hey, I'm thirsty. Where's that waiter? That does it. Mmm, <coughs> fruity but voluminous. There's no opening up here. There's no opening up here. Sleeping on the job. Ah, it's empty. Ooh. Ruben, where are you? Aha! Oh, mon dieu. Take a little nap. Hey, vous, eh? Well, le keg is le empty, so too sweet, Buster. Yes, monsieur. Merci anything you say. Hey, Joe, more wine? Oh, I'm going to foul him for ignoring my pleas, and then I believe I shall quit. Oh, I can never look at that pantry again. No man should ever be locked up in such a small, dark place.
here. Stuck. I can't squeeze through that crack. I can't squeeze through that crack. I can't squeeze through that crack. Squeeze through that crack. Dios mío, it's full of double end tickets. This could get a hundred souls on the number nine train. Something's not right about this. I get the feeling this suitcase belongs to someone more important than Chow Chilla Charlie. All right, Manny. Give me the case. Charles, I thought we had a bargain. No, we do. But I thought I'd bring some muscle along just in case. What's the matter, Chuck? Can't afford to hire goons to do this sort of work for you? I'm all the goon I need. Now drop it. You said it, boss. Got a card for me? Here. Welcome to the union, Manny. Meetings first Tuesday of every month, and, uh, don't forget to pay your dues. Don't forget to pay my dues. <laughs>
And the card? Let me see it. Oh, oh, oh. one of Charlie's rush jobs. Good thing your new captain's far-sighted. Uh, still no room for you on board. No word from Naranja, but he's done this before. But I'm first on the waiting list. As it were, yeah. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good. Because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. locked. Lola? Careful, Manny. You may not want to see me like this. Lola! Did Nick do this to you? Yeah, he wanted that picture real bad. But he's never gonna find it that fake. I'll get him, Lola. I'll show Max the picture for you and fix Nick for good. Just tell me where you hid it. Oh, Manny, it's all my fault. Always falling for the wrong guys. You know, I even had a thing for you once. But you were so hung up on that Meche woman, I figured I didn't have a chance. Lola, where's the picture? Tell me, Manny, when I've had a chance? Never mind. You just want Olivia for me. Tell her to improve her taste in men, or she'll end up just like me. Tell her to get a nice guy, Manny. Like you. Lola! Lola! Oh, Lola. Hey, there's a picture of a tongue on it.
Hi, this is a card from my new coat check system. You do care. Can I have my coat, please? You bet. This is so exciting. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. 22, 22, 22. Lengua, lengua, lengua. Aha! Here it is. Oh, darn. What's wrong? Just shoot me. Lupe, what is it? This can't be yours. That's it. Thanks. What are you doing with a tiny girl jacket? I don't suppose there was a camera back there anywhere. Uh, no. She must have hidden that somewhere else. Uh... I I'll tell you tomorrow. It's Lola's jacket. Poor Lola. If I only had her camera or that film, I could really get Nick. There's a little slip of paper in one of the pockets. All that this paper says is number 36, the rusty anchor. What is that supposed to mean? Just a dab will drop you. Hey, man, you didn't see me put the secret ingredient in these coffin shooters, did you? Re yeah. She steals from the rich and gives to me to pour.
Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. empty. Shot! Nemozogia, hold still, Matario. Dead. Ugh, Kaifa, wake up. I don't work on drunks. Resek Chavargo. What kind of sailor are you? <clears throat> Can't handle bulls, huh? What you the us gonna know? What anger met the name folks give his at me? The Taliashen Boland watcher. Well, let's go. Toto, I got your boy Naranya here. My A here. Well, he's sobered up. I send him to limbo. Yeah, yeah. He'll make it there by morning. Promise. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That is what I told him. Ah, uh, hang on a second. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Get away from that. Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, hang on a second. Ah, 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 ah. Get away from that. I gave him the idea in... Ah, uh, hang on a second. Ah, 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 ah. Get away from that. Ah. Uh. Tiger can't change his tra- Ah, uh, hang on a second. No, no, what are you thinking? So, you still going? I'm not using my union card for anything but getting on that boat. I'm not using my union card for anything but getting... Let's see what you got on you, huh, sailor? Seaman? Doesn't look like you'll be showing up to work in the morning. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I could put them on, but I don't think that would fool Velasco. Ah, uh, hang on a second. No, no, what are you thinking? Hey, listen to me. You got to take care of yourself. I don't really want to do that.
I don't really want to do that. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. Doesn't look like you'll be showing up to work in the morning. I don't think that would shed any light on things. I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled nautical and nice, and a third one just says Anchormania. Ah, uh, hang on a second. No, no, what are you thinking? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think that would shed any light on things. Thank you. 